all of whom were reportedly using Apple Pay. He continued to tap. It's like he had multiple bank accounts. If you or someone that you know, if you or someone that you know uses Apple Pay, okay, you most definitely want to make sure that they get, that they know about this information right away. Watch this. We can tell you tonight there is a warning to consumers to closely monitor your bank statements and Apple Pay accounts after a series mm -hmm. of thefts are discovered in the Mid-South. Andy Cordan has the story you're seeing first here on News 2. Law enforcement officers across the United States are now on the lookout for a sophisticated group of retail thieves who apparently have figured out how to crack Apple Pay to load up gift cards. This is pretty complex. It is very complex. According to Glenn Allred, the president of Alert Mid-South, which is an intel sharing group between law enforcement and retailers. We didn't realize the magnitude of it. This unidentified man was seen last week here in Nashville with four associates, all of whom were reportedly using Apple Pay mm -hmm. to load blank gift cards with cash that was stolen from unsuspecting people's bank accounts. He hit for probably 13 different locations in Nashville. What did he do? He went into uh, different retailers and he would grab gift cards, go over to the self-checkout and load them for $180 on the average and use his Apple Pay account to load them, which comes back as fraudulent account later. and. Uh, Somebody has to eat that charge. Mm -hmm. Allred says the group has been linked to similar crimes in Kentucky, Texas, and now Utah. So one of the videos that someone sent me, he continued to tap. It's like he had multiple bank accounts. And when one wouldn't go through, like somebody had already discovered it and closed it, he had another one and another one. So that's where we're at. We're trying to determine where they're getting and how they're getting all these bank accounts. Now they're linking them to their Apple or to Apple. That's concerning for Apple. So far, Allred says the group is responsible for losses up to $3 million. Have you talked to Apple representatives? I have not, but several of the law enforcement guys we're working with have. Are they concerned about this new breach of technology? They're very concerned and they're, they're trying to get in front of it really fast. The best advice at this time, continue to check your own financial data. Andy Cordan, News 2. And News 2 reached out to Apple for comments. So far, we have not heard back. Of course not. Of course they're not going to say anything, guys. They most definitely won't say anything. Listen, let's talk more about this, guys. So first off, good morning to you all. For those of you all who are just joining us, we've been talking about how thieves have been accused of stealing millions of dollars through Apple Pay in multiple states multiple bank accounts nationwide okay by the way if you guys haven't done so already be sure to like share and subscribe so for those of you who are just joining us here's the deal um a group of retail thieves um have figured out a way to crack apple pay so if you have an iphone apple pay is something that comes with that iphone uh, on a default okay however it's up to you optional to add your payment information, your debit card information, your credit card information, tickets, whatever you want. Um, some people add their boarding pass. It's really like Apple Wallet in a sense. But the pay structures is essentially cards that you use to pay. And what they're doing is they're hacking into people's Apple Pay uh, accounts to load up gift cards, okay? And what they're doing is that these have been linked to similar crimes. So they're telling everyone how to do this and it's happening right now as far as the news is concerned in Kentucky, in Texas, and of course now in Utah. So this is slowly spreading. So if you or someone that you know has Apple Pay, they need to know about this right away, okay? Next, the thieves are using Apple Pay to load blank gift cards with cash that was stolen from unsuspecting people's bank accounts. So essentially, if you have Apple Pay and you have a bank account, then you're at risk, okay? Now, obviously, no, everyone's not gonna get got by everything, but you still should know about what's going on, okay? And you're probably thinking, well, uh, it's not much that they've gotten away with, right? $20 here, $100 there, $1,000 there, no. The thieves have stolen an estimated amount of $3 million so far. Now, this has just been so far, okay? But $3 million so far 
has been stolen, guys. So again, this is something that's spreading fast in different states. Now, Apple says that they're investigating in the matter, but we have not heard anything from Apple uh, on this, okay? And then also too, guys, if you all just want um, eight, you know, just news about personal finance, personal credit, banks, things of that sort, credit unions. We have a new channel that we just launched as of yesterday. It's called 850 Club Credit News. Scan that QR code to learn more, okay? So for those of you all who are just joining us, we just went over what we just saw in the video. Let me know your thoughts inside the comments section below. Our Lake is in the house from California. Appreciate you being here, sir. And of course, Caleb is in the house as well. So again, let us know what your thoughts are, guys, um, you know, about this. Do you all have Apple Pay? Have you seen anything so far in the areas that you guys are in? OK, let us know inside the comments section below if you have, um, you know, of course, Apple Pay or if you've heard anything about this. I'm surprised Apple hasn't sent anything on this yet. OK, so we most definitely want to make sure that you all know about this and take advantage of the information as well. All right. So let me know your thoughts inside the comment section below, um, and then we can go from there. Now, also, too, guys, we do have um, the, like I mentioned about the 850 Club news channel. We're going to have more content um, just like this, essentially everything that's going on in the world that you may not hear about, because if it's not happening locally, you know, you know then no one's going to talk about it, right? And so that's where we're coming in at. We want to make sure that you know about things like this. If, if people have stolen $3 million, it's a matter of time before people start picking up on this. I saw one of the comments in another video, and it says, well, videos like this, less criminals know about it. Well, it, I'm sure new criminals may say, oh, but that's the thing. We can outweigh them. You know, we can out, you know, if we know about this stuff and it plays a role and you remove the things that's on your Apple Pay or whatever, and you could take it, you could do whatever you think is best, but you at least have to know about it. Does that, does that make sense? We want to make sure that people actually know about things that are going on because if they can use, if they can hack into your Apple Pay and load up gift cards, it's just a matter of time before they can look into other things as well. All right. But either way, let me know your thoughts on this. Um, if you guys are, do we have anyone, any, or does anyone that's watching our videos, are you all in Kentucky, in Texas, in Utah? Have you been hearing about this? Uh, let us know as well. <laughs> uh, 0627 says, I need to learn how they do this. <laughs> oh man. See, I don't know if people like, for, right. I, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure it's just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, it's crazy is that, uh, listen, as we show these types of things, we got to make sure you guys know about this stuff for real. OK, uh, because listen, it's it's always something new out there. That's the short version of all of this. There's always something new. And once we hear that it's legit, then we most definitely going to tell you guys. OK, but either way, we're not going to hold you guys up. We'll see you guys on the next video. So, again, the base sure you guys go ahead and scan that QR code. If you guys want just just the credit news only, we just started a new channel. Scan that QR code. Let me know your thoughts inside the comment section below. We're going to swing back into it. And again, thanks for watching. Make sure you guys like, share and subscribe. We'll see you all.